Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Samantha Rizundu and today we have a new episode of New to Oz Beauty Edition. If you haven't been here before, what I do is give you the rundown of what is new in makeup for Australians as we often experience delays and it's very confusing when we're getting something. So I let you know when you can get something, where you can get it and now. So let's get into it. I'm going to start off with Mecca. So Mecca has brought out, this was already at David Jones, I believe. But now Mecca has the Bobbi Brown Intensive Skin Serum Foundation, SPF 25, and that retails for $93. When I first saw this, I really did want to try it. Intensive Skin Serum. So I like that it's at Mecca now because you can get points at Mecca, which is always a bonus. Um, so yeah, I would really like to see what this is like. Unfortunately, we're at that stage where you can't swatch things still. And I'm a big swatcher, especially with foundation. I like to see how it um, sinks into my skin. So maybe I'll just wait. We'll see. And next we have from Too Faced. It's a lovely little set. It's called the Damn... Wait a second. This is the longest title ever, so bear with me. Damn Girl Those Lashes and Lips. Shamelessly Thick Lashes and Lip Plumper Set. $29. <laughs> So this is basically the Damn Girl Mascara and the Lip Plumper Lip Gloss. And they're both in travel size, which is not bad for $29. I think that's a pretty good deal. And then also from Too Paste, Too Paste, the Diamond Light Fire Bronzer. This looks so interesting for $58. So the I like the looks of this, but is it too orange? It's one of those things you have to see in person. Because it says it's a bronzer, all the other ones are highlighters. So I interpreted this as like a highlighter for deeper skin tones. But it says here fire bronzer. So you tell me. Am I reading this wrong? Um, it looks kind of orangey, but I'm still really intrigued. From Morphe, we have the 9V Vintage Rose Palette for $18. And the 9W Smoke and Shadow Palette for also $18. These look really nice. I really like the Smoke and Shadow one. $18, 9W. I'll keep a lookout. Like, I always said I don't like Morphe, but then they come out with $18 beautiful palettes, and I'm like, maybe I do want to follow everyone else and buy Morphe. From Ciate London, we have the new Fierce Flick Eyeliner for $29. I don't know what this is like. No one's really been talking about this one. And then also from Urban Decay, they came out with an extension of their Moon Dust range. So we have the Lip Eclipse for $35, and they come in four shades. I don't know about these. Um, personally, I don't like the looks of the fact that it's a shimmer lip. Like, I think shimmer lips are okay, but I don't know these colors. And the same with the Liquid Face and Body Illuminizer for $55. That comes in three shades. And to me, they're very strange shades. I think these, uh, this line is more editorial if you're wanting to do like a more artistic look. It would be really nice, but not for everyday neutral, which, I mean, that is Urban Decay's thing, isn't it? It's a little bit edgy. From NARS, speaking of extending from existing lines, we have the NARS Orgasm line. So we all know that NARS is a great brand, but they push the orgasm range so much no one likes it anymore. Like, no one wants it. No one wants it. We have the Mini Orgasm Eyeshadow Palette for $40. The Orgasm and Cheek Palette, $67. The Ultimate Orgasm Set for $78. And the Eyeshadow Quad for $83. And that comes in two different shades. Okay, so from YSL, we have the... Here we go. Testing my French. Tatouge Couture Velvet Cream, $62. And that comes in 14 shades. This looks really nice. Velvet Cream Lip Product. Okay, new brand from Mecca. 
Okay, I'm pretty sure this is an Australian brand and it's all clean, clean beauty. I say Ere Perez. Ere, Ere Perez. Yeah, Ere. Ere Perez. <laughs> I'm the worst. Okay, so I there's a whole bunch of products, so I'm just going to give you some highlighted ones that I thought looked really interesting. So the Oat Milk Foundation, it is a cream foundation created with natural oat milk for a hydrating, non-greasy, breathable, and long-wearing finish. So it's a natural finish with medium to full coverage, and it has ingredients like oat milk, peach, and vitamin E to promote healthy skin. Okay, we've only got six shades. But I do wonder what this would be like. It sounds really nice. And then we had the Carrot Color Pot. Vegan carrot infused cream colors into your cheeks and lips for a natural pop of color packed full of hydrating antioxidants. So that also sounds really good. And there's really nice natural colors. The one that I showed you is the brightest one. I thought that was super pretty. Also got the Arnica Concealer, $36. And that comes in six shades which isn't bad so the arnica concealer is a vegan naturally derived cream concealer that works to camouflage redness dark circles and blemishes uh, with the added benefits of skin soothing arnica this is full coverage but buildable this creamy formula melts into the skin to mask redness blah 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 so arnica is considered to have healing and anti-inflammatory properties under your eyes Yes, please. Okay, and then this next one, I, I love the names. I'm really intrigued. I've actually looked this brand up before because it's Clean Beauty and I was researching some Clean Beauty to try. And then voila, it popped up at Mecca. So we have the Beetroot Cheek and Lip Tints and there's two shades. We've got like a hot pink and more of a watermelon color. And this is a long-lasting tint for cheeks and lips and is made with sweet, vibrant beetroot and adds a natural-looking flush to all skin tones. That sounds really nice as well. And then lastly from the line, I wanted to... This one caught my eye too. It's the Corn Translucent Powder. It doesn't look translucent though. It does have a tint of yellow to it. That's what the picture shows me. So this is a non-GMO corn to create an invisible layer that hides shine and helps reduce redness. This versatile powder doubles as a finishing powder for a flawless finish. I like that. Use it to absorb oil when required or as a setting powder for longevity of your look. I would like to try the whole line. I'm just going to say it. I really, really want to try this. And then lastly from Mecca, they've brought out some really nice things this fortnight. We have the Ardell Naked Lashes for $12.99 each. I know there was like three or four pairs and they honestly all look really good. I've kind of gone off lashes because they just feel too heavy. But something like this and this price point, yes please, uh, really natural looking, invisible band, if I were to wear lashes now, that's all I want. All the lashes in my drawers, I don't even want to wear them anymore. I find them just too heavy. I want really natural lashes to make my lashes look like they're just amped up without looking fake. From Sephora, we have the Pixie Collagen Lip Gloss for $28. And this is for when you're not wearing any other lip products. That's kind of what it was insinuating. Um, just like your at night time or no makeup type of lip gloss. And then we also have the Marc Jacobs, are you ready for this? This is a long one too. Marc Jacobs Beauty Everything goes with Blacker four piece essential set with a bag, spring runway edition, $105. It's like a whole sentence title, it's insane. So included in that, we have the highliner gel crayon in Blacker, the sequence glam glitter eyeshadow in glitter rock, which looks really nice. I think this is a beautiful little set. Uh, the Lamarck lip cream in cream and sugar, beautiful. The Velvet Noir major volume mascara noir, beautiful. And the collectible makeup bag. Don't really care about makeup bags, but everything else in this actually sounds really good. From Huda Beauty, we have legit lashes double ended volumizing and lengthening mascara for $50. So this mascara features two custom brushes and formulas designed to give 
you the perfect lashes. Whether you use both sides together or separate, this mascara allows you to customize your look according to your mood. This formula includes gripping waxes and fibers for an immediate elongated effect with a curved brush to boost length, define and curl even your tiniest lashes. Well, I got tiny lashes, so maybe this is the mascara for me. From Priceline, when I clicked on Priceline's website, I was shocked to say the least. Have any of you seen or heard the word on the street, wet and wild at Priceline? Just the collab with Bretman Rock, the beauty YouTuber. And it makes me think, are you teasing us? Are you going to give us wet and wild? Or are you just giving us this collab? Now they couldn't do that. They'd have to give us the whole thing, right? They can't just give us one collab and disappear. Do you think Wet n Wild's coming to Priceline, guys? Oh my God, could you imagine? $5 highlighters, $5 bronzers, $5 foundations. Oh my God. Anyway, we've got the Bretman Rock range, which includes the face highlighting brush, $12.95, the lip gloss in Ferocity, $12.95, the 3-in-1 Face Mist for $14.95, the Loose Highlighter Duo for $14.95, and the Shadow Palette for $24.95. I have mentioned this before because it's available on, I think, Discount Beauty Boutique. So it's already available for Australians, but this is easily accessible if they put this in store. <gasps> Please put Wet n Wild in store. Priceline, do it. You won't regret it. You won't regret it. Beauty Bay, we have one of my faves. So Paul and Joe is an old school brand, been around forever. It really looks like they're trying to make a comeback and I think they're doing pretty well. So they've got this limited edition lipstick for $40.50 and it comes in three shades. So this looks really interesting. It looks like it's got the pigment in the middle and then the clear on the outside, which has got that beautiful um, K-Beauty look where it's just kind of like, in the middle of your mouth it's pretty like that blotted look and then we have these sparkling eye color for $38.50 and this comes in five shades aren't these so cute so uh, Tara babies the youtuber who does hauls every Saturday I'm obsessed with her she just hauls everything you could ever want I don't know how she affords it it's not my business but she buys everything if you like watching haul videos Tara babies with a Z one word. So good. Anyway, she hauled the brown and green one in the picture and it actually made me want to buy it. So it's not heavily pigmented, but that's what I liked about it. It was like this brownie green color. If you just had that on your lid, it would look so stunning. So I, would, I wouldn't look at this twice unless I saw that Tara Baby's had bought this. And then lastly from Paul and Joe, we have the matte pressed powder for $54. From Milani, there we have a couple of products. We have the Ludicrous Lip Gloss for $26, and that comes in 12 shades. And then we have the Ludicrous Matte Lip Crayon for $25, and that comes in 13 shades. And the shades, like, were really vast. So they had, like, these, like, it looked to me like a navy. It was quite interesting. So it wasn't just your typical neutrals and reds and pinks. It had a variety of colors. It had a really, really deep chocolate brown as well. Okay, new brand at Beauty Bay. I think there was always Anastasia Beverly Hills, but now the Norvina line. And I don't really classify the Norvina line as ABH. I know that it is, but they're so different. I would just call this Norvina. She's brought out these new electric cake liners for $59.75 each. And they're not in Australian Sephora yet, which is why I'm mentioning this, because if you really, really wanted it, it's on the Beauty Bay website. And that comes in two different color sets. So there are sets of three and there's two different options you can pick. And then also from the Norvina collection, we have the Pro Pigment Palette Volume and this retails for $131.25. I think this is really pretty. It doesn't really appeal to me. If any of those volumes appealed to me, it was the third one with the oranges and the greens. I thought that one was actually stunning. Okay, and then Melt Cosmetics. Oh my god. This 420 palette is screaming my name. 
It retails for $94.50 and all of these shades with my, I was going to say orange, you don't call it orange hair, with my red hair, it's everything that I want in an eyeshadow palette. I'm really tempted to buy it, but like $95, that's just crazy. Um, apparently her formula is amazing. I've always wanted to try the brand and it comes with two gel liners. Her gel liners already exist, but these are two new shades with this 420 collection. And that is in, and they retail for $30 and 95 cents. And it comes in the shade Spliff, which is the brown one and Wallflower, which is the more green one. And they look stunning as well. Like I'm really into this whole collection. So Beautylish, we have from Ilia the two new powder products. We have the Nightlight Bronzing Powder for US $34 and the Daylight Highlighter for US $34. I'm mentioning this because it's available on Beautylish. I'm anticipating that it will come to Mecca if you're willing to wait. But if you're not willing to wait, that's why I mention it now. So the Ilia bronzer and highlighter are both talc free because this is a clean beauty brand. And they both include a Hova seed oil, a non, I can never say this word, non comedogenic oil that hydrates and nourishes, silica beads, a natural powder that creates a soft focus filter with a silky slip. From Glam Radar, we have a continuation from Kimchi Beauty, which we mentioned last week. The brand has just brought out concealers and they're called the Most Concealer. We have, I've separated them. They're both $23 the range, but one range is color correctors, which I'll show in the picture. And the color corrector range is spot on. Talk about inclusivity. It has got a deep red for deeper skin tones. And so many people don't do that. They do oranges, but some people need more of a red color corrector. Congratulations, Kimchi. You are on it. And then you've got like these, I don't know what pale blue does. I don't know what baby blue does in color correcting, but I'm very impressed. I really hope this formula is good because then they also brought out the regular concealer skin tone shades for $23 each. And there are 17 shades. And I'm just going to show you the lightest and the darkest. Good job. Really good job. This is a small indie brand doing inclusivity across all brands. Does that not show that it is possible? So I really, really want to promote that. And Glam Raider, $23 is such a good price point for this concealer. I would really like to try this. I want to support this brand, not just because of that, but I mentioned last fortnight the highlighter palette was screaming my name. These concealers are screaming my name. And then from Luna Beauty, we have the new Moon Prism range. We have the blush palette for $54 and three lip glosses in Moon, Celine and Starlight for $26 each. From a Discount Beauty Boutique, we have from Amore Us, the Moon Pressed Pigment Palette for $35 and the Sun Pressed Pigment Palette for $35. From Cara Beauty, which is also another brand I want to try. It's affordable and their eyeshadow palettes look really good. The We have the Weekender palette for $35. Okay, all of these Cara Beauty palettes are $35, so I don't repeat myself. The Retro Chic palette, I'm Just a Girl palette, and the ES49 Galaxy Glitter palette. From Ofra Cosmetics, they did a collab with Samantha March, and if you're not familiar with her, she has a YouTube channel, and I love her. Does anyone else watch Samantha March? I would like to know in the comments. Let me know. She is really cool. She does a lot of, uh, like, she does a lot of reviews, but she also does, like, when I say commentary, like dis beauty discussion videos, which I really like as well, I like doing those and I like watching those. So she did a collab with Ofra and this looks really, really good. If I had endless amounts of money, I would 100% get this. We have the River Bronzer Duo for $42. And the reason why I like her collab so much is because you've got a matte side and a shimmer side. And with bronzers and blushes, I like the option of matte, shimmer, or mixed. And this is just something that I would really, really like to try. And then we've also got the Chick Lit Blush Duo also for $42.
and side by side they're just so beautiful if i were to get one i'm just a sucker for bronzers so i probably got the bronzer uh because i love a shimmer bronzer i love a matte bronzer and then blend the two that will look so good and then lastly from discount beauty boutique we have the model rock base maker pro three pack all over shaper sponge for 24.95 okay so i have to mention this charlotte tilbury free shipping over 150 dollars if you buy it two things from them, you'll be good. We have the new airbrush bronzers. Now I've mentioned this on her website, specifically because it's not available anywhere else right now. If you want it right now, you have to get it directly from Charlotte Tilbury's website, which does ship to Australia. Uh, so it's free shipping over 150. And I bought these bronzers and I showed apparently. I, I could not, I could not. I, the moment I saw it, I, it was honestly love at first sight. Love. So we have the airbrush bronzers, $75, and they come in four shades. And the fair to medium is such a skip. I didn't know which one to get. So I ended up getting the fair, but the fair looks really fair. But then the medium looks like it could be too deep. So I wasn't really sure what to do. So I just, I got the fair because, you know, I am fair. These are supposed to go on like butter, like so airbrush, like their powders because I've been watching reviews. I can't help myself and everyone just loves it. Everyone's loving it. And then we have the airbrush bronzing brush for $60, which is a little kabuki brush that is travel friendly and the luxury palette desert haze for $80. And this is what I also bought. And I have no regrets because those are my shades. Those are my shades. I'm so excited. I could cry. I'm so excited. From Linda Holberg, we have free shipping over US $60. I didn't bother trying converting that to Australian, but it's worldwide shipping over 60 US dollars. We have the Infinity Power Lash Waterproof Mascara for US $29. And this waterproof mascara is the future of waterproof mascaras. Uh, the intense rubbing off of the waterproof mascara days are over. That's what they said. With an incredible staying power that will keep your eyelashes curled and in place without smudging or flaking, the formula is gentle enough to easily be removed with an oil-based makeup remover. And then we have, this is what really intrigued me, is the Ultimate Lips Lip Primer for 19 US dollars. It will prevent your lipstick from fading, bleeding, and creasing. I don't have a major issue with that. But if I wore a liquid lipstick, sometimes I get a little bit um, in the edges here. And this would be perfect for that. I just bought a W7 lip primer. That's supposed to be for non-feathering, just like this. It's not, it's not good. It's not good. So that completes everything for today and for the fortnight. I'm really keeping a close eye to see if there is a real increase in product movement and releases that I will go back to doing this weekly. It's just, it seems pointless to do it weekly if I'm only going to be doing like a 10 minute video. So I think it's better that I'm waiting and doing fortnightly at the moment, but I have noticed releases are starting to pick up again because America's not in lockdown anymore. Australia is not in lockdown anymore. So I think things are starting to pick up again, which is exciting. It means we're going back to reality guys. Okay. We're going back to reality. Other than that, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.